State your name. Shalom, Brother Jehu. All right. Brother Jehu, why did you join IUIC? Um, I decided to join IUIC because out of all the camps, they were the most, most organized. Um, watching on the internet, looking at some other camps, even coming across some live and in person downtown Chicago. It didn't seem like they was really focused on their people. They were uniform. They was arguing back and forth with each other. And watched a couple of IUIC videos and realized it was real organized. Uh, they stated what their purpose and their focus was, and they stuck on that, and that stuck out to me. How long have you been with IUIC? Been with IUIC for about 11 months. What made you decide to look for the Most High? Um, been in Christianity for about 15 years, so I was always looking for the Most High. Only difference is that in Christianity they teach you to master the order of service, but they don't really teach you nothing about God. So um, I was really curious about who the Most High really was, how you look in the Old Testament and realize that he has all of these standards. You know what I mean? He has this order, and then a New Testament comes about, and according to Christianity, it's now you can do whatever you want, and God doesn't care. And I thought that was strange to me, so it made me more curious. What scripture said the deal for you to walk in truth? I would have to say Deuteronomy 28 and 68, uh, dealing with the slave ships, knowing that I'm a descendant of the slave trade, and actually seeing that being brought about in the Bible, it was a real big game changer for me. What makes you continue to stay with IUIC? Um, what makes me stay with IUIC is that um, what I like most is that they keep the commandments and the same requirements for the newest person is also the same requirements for the bishops and the elders, um, that they show no respect of person and the fact that from the top all the way to the bottom everybody gets dealt with and judged the same way and that the most high is at the forefront, not a person. Okay, quote your favorite scripture. Uh, my favorite scripture would have to be 1 John 2 and 3 which says, um, and hereby do we know that we know him, that we keep his commandments. And then it goes on to verse four that says, anyone who says they know him and does not keep his commandments is a liar and the truth is not in him. Basically that scripture, what it did for me was it set a standard and it set a boundary. So then it helped me to know if I was really on the Lord's side or not, just off of that alone. Daniel of Israel United in Christ. Please subscribe to our YouTube channels. Stay up to date with our latest events, music, and classroom lessons. IUIC plans to continue visiting different countries where this gospel has not been preached before. IUIC needs your help in pushing this truth. So join us, subscribe to our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and podcast, and stay up to date with us. For more information, please visit www.israelunite.org.